Could a new way to test for COVID-19 soon be available? Safe to say we've all had quite enough of the no swabs, but now the FDA has granted emergency use authorization for the first COVID-19 breath test. It's called the Inspect IR COVID-19 breathalyzer. Instead of swabbing their nose, the patient breathes for about 10 seconds into a disposable straw connected to the device. The entire unit is about the size of a piece of carry-on luggage. The system then searches for five compounds associated with a COVID-19 infection. Results take about three minutes. A study found the breathalyzer accurately identified more than 91% of positive samples and nearly 100% of negative samples. A separate study found it was just as accurate at detecting the Omicron variant. The breathalyzer is designed to be used in medical offices and at mobile testing sites. While this is the first actual breath test to be authorized, a furry version has already been in use. Scientists discovered early on in the pandemic that dogs could be trained to sniff out metabolic changes in COVID positive people. They've been used in several countries at airports and other public places. The Miami Heat even used COVID sniffing dogs to screen fans before they entered the arena. And three school districts in Massachusetts are using COVID sniffing dogs as well. The dogs don't sniff individual students, but if the dog hits on a child's seat, their parents are contacted and recommended to get a COVID test. The company behind the Inspect IR COVID-19 breathalyzer expects to make about 100 testing units a week. The FDA does still recommend the results of the breath test be confirmed with a PCR test. So those nasal swabs are definitely going to be around for a little while longer.